today we're going to be replacing a, I call it an antenna boot. I think it's technically called an antenna ornament. Basically holds the antenna to keep it wobbling so much. You can see the rubber piece is completely gone from around this one. First thing you got to do is get the, uh, get the antenna off. side. I'm going to try to get the old piece out. Needle nose are good for that. There you go. You can see it's pretty messed up. Do you have a new piece? Here. Uh, what I would do is take some index, spray it on here. Just gives it a little bit of lubrication. And it's easier to clean off than WD 40 or something like that. I just want to slide it down over top of that piece and then work it down into place. And here is the finished product. Seal it around the side and it's nice firm foundation for the antenna. So this was a difficult installation. Um, now I went with a very cheap boot um, and I think that probably getting a uh, OEM part uh, would be a better bet. Um, the boot I got was very very stiff and I tried heating it um, I tried, you know, using a screwdriver to kind of wedge it into the, uh, into the opening. Um, and what I actually ended up having to resort to was taking a razor blade and trimming down some of the, um, the in, inside of it so that it would fit better into the hole. Um, and then the, uh, the, the hole for the antenna itself, uh, I believe was too deep so that the, uh, threads of the antenna wouldn't actually reach all the way down uh, to the piece that it screws into. So what I had to do there was take a drill bit and actually drill the hole out a little bit so that the antenna would fit down in there far enough uh, to get a good bite on the threads. So I would recommend getting an OEM part, softer rubber, so that it would be easier uh, to snap that back into place. But ultimately I did get this done and, uh, and we have a new boot there for our antenna so that it will uh, not rattle as much as we're driving down the road. Thanks for watching. Subscribe down below. I'll put some links in there to the parts I used. And uh, thank you so much.